Hi everyone, I'm Paige. I'll be guiding us through this 15 minute stretch and release class. For today, you need a yoga mat. If you don't have a yoga mat, you can use a towel and also a block. If you don't have a block, you can use a cushion. So we'll be starting sitting on the block or cushion with the legs crossed. Shutting down the eyes as you lengthen from the base of the tailbone, up the spine, back of the neck, to the crown of your head. Bringing awareness to the breath. How's the quality of your breathing? Noticing the breath as it changes shape. With each inhale, filling up. And exhale, softening, empty. Inhale, allow the breath to through your whole lungs to the bottom of your belly. Exhale, the breath floats all the way back up, out through your nose. Keep that steady rhythm of breath going. Long, slow inhale. Full, steady exhale. Gently opening the eyes. As you inhale, arms out wide, hands in line with shoulders, palms face down. Exhale, palms face up. Inhale, palms together above the head. Exhale, hands to heart space. Inhale, hands out wide, palms face down. Exhale, palms face up. Inhale, palms together above the head. Exhale, hands to heart space. Breathe in, hands out wide, palms down. Breathe out, palms up. Inhale, palms together above the head. Interlacing your fingers, palms to the back of your skull. So fingers are interlaced, palms to the back of your skull. Really pressing head into the palms, palms into the head, elbows out wide. Lengthening through the spine, take a full breath in. Exhale, curling in, chin to chest, elbows towards each other. Inhale, lift from the back of the heart, elbows out wide. Exhale, curl in, chin to chest. Inhale, elbows are wide. Exhale, elbows towards each other, gazing at belly button. A couple more in your own breath at your own pace. Your next inhalation, keeping elbows out wide, reaching the hands up towards the sky, and slowly, slowly the hands float down, very slowly. There's no rush. When you're ready, interlacing fingers behind the back. This may be enough for you. Your option is to straighten the arms. Really roll the toe blades in and down your back. Opening the chest. Opening the heart. Tilting head to the right side. Gentle neck stretch. Just finding that sweet spot for you. Take a full breath in. Full breath out. Inhale, head to center. Exhale, head over towards the left side. Inhale. Full exhale. Take a full breath in. Full breath out. 
while more full inhale. And so exhale, slowly head to center, placing palms face down on your thighs or knees, gentle neck rolls, going in whatever direction you wish. If you find a stiff spot, you may like to pause there, just noticing how that feels. Very slowly in the other direction. There's no wrong or right, just doing what feels good in your body at this very moment in time. When you're ready, head to center, placing your block or cushion to the side, sitting on your mat with the legs crossed. Placing your right hand to the left knee, left hand behind, fingers face away, peeling back left shoulder. Bringing the gaze to where you want to go in the stretch. If you'd like to twist a little bit more, look in that direction first. Imagine that someone's pulling string from the crown of your head. One more full breath in. Exhale, releasing. Inhale, lengthen through the spine. Exhale, hands to the earth. As you fold forward, let the head be heavy. Not worrying about how the posture looks but more how it feels. Surrendering a little bit more on each breath out. Surrendering to stillness. Surrendering to this moment right now. As you inhale, sitting up, placing your left hand to the right knee, right hand behind, fingers face away, peeling back right shoulder. Then pressing palm to the knee, knee to the palm. You know, you say that twisting it is very nourishing for the liver, the kidneys, and the gallbladder especially. One more full breath in. Exhale, back to center. Finding your tabletop position. Tabletop. This are directly underneath the shoulders. Knees are directly underneath the hips, really spreading fingers wide. Knees are about hip width apart for a few rounds of cat-cow. Inhale, gaze is forward, tailbone towards the sky. Exhale, round the spine, gazing at your belly button. Inhale, pulling heart and tailbone away from each other. Exhale, Tucking pelvis. Inhale like you're tucking your head under a fence, slide to the left of your back. Exhale, chin to chest. Inhale, belly button towards the earth. Exhale, gazing at belly button. You inhale, neutral spine, take a top position. Inhale, right arm reaches up. Exhale, right hand floats down. Inhale, left hand floats up. Exhale, down. Inhale, right arm up. Exhale, down. Inhale, left arm up. So you exhale, threading left arm underneath your right armpit. Option here is to have a block or 
pushing underneath the left side of your face for more support. Option with the right hand is to reach it towards the right top corner of your mat or towards the left top corner of your mat. Or option to have your right hand behind the back. Just finding a variation that feels comfortable in your body. Soften the jaw so there's a slight space between top and bottom teeth. Soften the cheekbones. Softening the space between your eyebrows. Soften the temples. Soften the forehead. Inhale, placing both hands back onto the earth, finding your tabletop position. Inhale, left arm floats up. Exhale, left hand down. Inhale, right arm up. You exhale, threading right arm underneath your left armpit. Option to have block or cushion underneath the right side of your face for more support left hand option to reach left hand towards left top corner of the mat or to intensify right top corner of the mat like you're sticking your head from underneath your armpit or option for left hand behind the back on each breath in imagine the breath covering up the spine to the crown of your head exhale down the spine out through the tailbone, letting go. Inhale up the spine, contemplating what is valuable to you at this moment in time. Exhale down the spine, letting go of anything that no longer serves you. When you're ready, finding your tabletop position. Wrists are at the knees, the shoulders, and placing your knees a little further back than your hips. So knees are about a foot back from your hips as you slowly lower down onto the belly in five, four, three, two. One, placing your elbows directly underneath the shoulders, really rolling shoulder blades down the back, sending your heart forward. Can you press your fingertips into the earth, really pressing fingertips and pelvis towards each other? You may be able to feel the sensation in the lower back, just be very gentle here with your lower back only about 70 percent option is to stay here this may be enough or option to place your hands to the edge of the the mat fingers face away straightening the arms however if this feels too much then feel free to come back to option one to see how the lower back feels. Is there any warmth, tingling, electrical-like feelings? Or perhaps it's a dull ache. Is the sensation staying in the one spot? Or perhaps it's spreading radiating. One more full breath in. 
exhale, releasing chest floats down to the earth, pushing back into child's pose. Knees are wide, big toes together, sitting bones towards the heels, hands reach in front, forehead to your mat, or option to rest forehead on your block or cushion for more support. Bringing awareness to the breath. Whenever the mind begins to wander, bringing awareness back to the breath. On each breath in, belly expanding. On each breath out, belly contracting, drawing towards the spine. Inhale, belly expands. Exhale. How belly contracts. As you're ready, when you're ready, slowly sitting up in a comfortable seated position. Perhaps legs crossed, hands to heart space in prayer position. Namaste. Thank you joining me today or tonight wherever you are if you enjoy the practice thank you